April 12th, I gave birth to a beautiful little girl, which we named Alicia Amber. We feel very lucky and grateful with this beautiful Nordic child, born here in northern Norway. In the evening of 11 April, we drove to the hospital after I started to have some light contractions. We brought our little boy Torsten to his aunt and thereafter drove to the hospital, which is one and a half hour away from where we are living. When we arrived in the hospital and after a checkup, it turned out I was only dilated 2 cm, so they advised me to go to sleep and see if my body could pick it up later. Later that night things developed very fast and I had a beautiful natural birth in the water and she was born at half past three in the night. After that night I stayed some days in the hospital to recover and spend some time with her alone. After three days my partner and her son came pick us up to go home. Right now it's the beginning of May and the snow finally start to melt in the mountains. After a long winter with a lot of snow, nature is waking up from a deep winter sleep. We really can't wait for the spring to arrive.
first time when I went outside again for a walk, my whole body felt very weak. But it was also a special moment with my two little ones, both in the stroller. A moment I was really looking forward to, and will never forget. From now on, all our focus will be on the renovation of our Norwegian farmhouse, which is going good but very slow, because the house has to be totally renovated. It's good to work on a dream and to come closer and closer. Sometimes it's difficult that things are going slow, but it makes it better if you realize and accept that certain things just need time for a good outcome. Last month was not only special because of the birth of Alicia, but also because it's one year ago since we moved from the border of the Netherlands and Germany to Northern Norway. So much things have happened since that time. So much to start up since we came here. We've been adapting to a more simple lifestyle, what feels very good for us.
We also experience our first winter here, and I'm looking back on a good time with a lot of magic. I feel a lot of appreciation to be and live here, but now I'm looking very much forward to the spring and summertime and to go into a new season. I like the big contrast between light and dark here. Because we're living above the Arctic Circle, it will be light the whole day and night from now on. I can't wait for the new season and spend more time outside and work in my garden, eat fresh fish and drink cold water from the mountains. <laughs> 